A special moment for the University of Miami, Mario Cristobal, now officially in command. It is official. The University <laughs> of Miami has a brand new head football coach. Yeah, Mario Cristobal was introduced within the hour. Local 10 Sports Director Will Manzo is live in Coral Gables, and this is truly a homecoming for Cristobal, Will. It, it felt like a party here, Janice, to be honest. It really felt that feel of seeing old faces, familiar faces, or in the words of Mario Cristobal, seeing the U family. He is a big part of the family, and now he is back here in South Florida, where he was born and raised as the 26th head coach of the Miami Hurricanes football program. Now, there was only one glitch on the day. The jersey they gave him, the number one Cristobal jersey, just a little small. Cristobal is a former offensive lineman, but he ended up giving that to one of his sons. But you know what? Well, after aside, Tears aside, Cristobal said he had all the emotions going on in taking this job, leaving Oregon where he had a very, Man, very good job for the last few years with making a lot of money to come here with a 10-year, $80 million contract to come back home. And the story as he told it, among the many things he spoke about today were the reasons for coming back is wanting to bring the U back to that place he was at, a championship level, and also the enticement of being around his family, including his mom, who right now unfortunately is ill. Guys, we are Miami. We are the U. And every time you hear that, every time you see that on a shirt, on a commercial, at a game, that's got to mean everything. And we got to show it in everything that we do. I am here. I'm a small piece of a big operation that's going to invest every ounce of my existence to make sure that we get to the level that we need to get to. My family's here, my brother, his wife, my nephews, you know. My goddaughter, everybody's here. Um, my mom is, you know, she's close by in the hospital. She's fighting. So she'll, she'll get the news, you know, when she's ready for it. You know, I don't, I don't want to cause more issues and have to have more care at the hospital, you know, when she knows. But home is home, you know. And this home is special. It's the most culturally diverse, vibrant, energized destination city in the entire world. As we come back out live, there's Mario Cristobal. You can probably see him there. He's kind of walking back behind the set up there, the podium where it was. Mario has been here for over an hour now since the press conference finished, talking to different media members, talking to different people from around the community, old friends, yes, family still here, University of Miami family. This felt like a true homecoming for Mario Cristobal. And with that 10-year contract, well, he better get it right with that homecoming. The Hurricanes are hoping this is the last head coach that they hire for a very long time. He told me when I spoke to him a short time ago that he's not going to make any proclamations. This isn't about promising national titles. It's about promising that he'll get the right people around him, players and staff, to work hard to get back to those national titles. And he said after he has a protein shake in a few minutes, he's going to get right back out there, start with the recruiting process, and get to work with some long days ahead to turn this program around. That's the story from Coral Gables. I'm Will Manso, Local 10 News. Exciting times indeed, and you can stay on top of all the change in command at the U. Just uh, pull out that phone right now, scan the QR code on your screen. It'll take you straight to our sports section on local10.com.